Hi folks. Today, um, now I'm usually on the vent. In fact, I'm supposed to be on the vent uh, all, at all times right now because of my respiratory condition. Um, but however, since I am stable right now, I'm, I'm sad and well right now, I would like to talk to you just for a few minutes. I know I'm supposed to be on the vent, but I want to do a little lecture, and it could be months before I'm actually permitted to do Tiki's trial. <laughs> but, however, I want to do this lecture, because I want people to know who are on the road to recovery, and who are able to do trick mask, and may even... They, maybe some of you are actually blessed to be able to do TP's trials at home because the TP beats the trait mask. So I'm going to talk to you about the what a TP's trial is. A TP. Um, this is I'm going to show you a nebulizer grade TP. This is not designed for humidification trial. You would not use one of these on a patient to get to, to have them do a T-piece trial. This would be for a nebulizer grade T-piece that would go in line with a vent, whether an LTV or a trilogy. But you guys know what a T looks like. Obviously, you would if you heard your... If you learned your ABCs in school, and if you learned, learned how to write, you would know, and of course all of you did, obviously, but you would know that a T looks like this. Now, in some variations, like if you write in cursive, <coughs> you might, um, a T might look a wee bit different. But what is a teacher's trial? I've been talking for like, I don't know, five minutes maybe about what a tea looks like, but a tea juice trial is essentially used for, like in the hospital, if you're on a ventilator and if you're getting off a short period of time, you might be put on a tea piece. And essentially, it just looks like a tea. Now this is a Ballard or an inline suction converted into it. Now why do I prefer a tea piece over a trait collar. The trait collar is just a trait mask. But a T-piece actually gives you 100% humidity. It gives you more precise humidity. A trait mask, you have less humidity. Of course, a trait mask might be more suitable for those um, who move around a lot, who mobilize, who mobilize, who walk around, and who are more prone to um, dislodgement of the adapter or even a tray call. And essentially, essentially, a tea piece just gives you high flow humidity from a compressor or in the case of a hospital setting, a wall outlet, either air or and or oxygen. So I'm getting oxygen, um, excuse me, I'm getting air why did I say oxygen? I'm getting air for the, from this, through this tea piece. So in the future, when I am able to, if I ever am, and I'm hoping to be able to, to do short periods on the tea piece trial, because I'll have an option between a trait collar or a tea piece. And I'm going to do a tea piece. I don't want some trait collar, because trait collars don't give you pure humidity. And of course, since I'll be on these longer, if I ever get to be able to do TP's trial, I'll be on oxygen, which means I'll be on an oxygen, there'll be a, 
connector or I bleed an oxygen. When you're doing a TP's file, you're not getting any supplemental ventilatory support. You're just getting high flow humidity. And that's about it. With supplemental oxygen, if oxygen things that in. But that's about it. And so you're not getting pressure support and you're not getting ventilatory support. So there's a little bit of detail about a TP's trial. Usually these are, most of the time, they're done in the hospital. However, I like TP's over tray collar. So, if I ever do get to the point where I can do a period, longer period of time off the event, I'm going for a TP's trial not a trade call. I hope this video was in informative about a two-piece trial and about when you might use them and what the difference is between them and complete ventilatory support. Have a good day. May God bless you and keep you. And remember, only He can love you perfectly. Thank you.